One, two, two three. three. <laughs> Hey guys, welcome to Stir Crazy, the show that's less a talk show than really just my call for help. You know my guest from True Detective, San Andreas, and the new film We Summon the Darkness, it's Alexandra Daddario. Hello. It's good to see you. How are you holding up in this bizarre new world of ours? I'm okay. Um, I am, you know, starting my day early. It's always good when I get out of bed before nine. So this is the win, okay. I've been coming up with like a lot of just like, just things to keep me busy throughout the day. Is there a new routine? Is there a new kind of schedule that you've set for yourself? A lot of it involves wine. Like I never used to drink this much wine ever, uh, especially not at the hours that I've started drinking it. That's that's a huge change. So what time does the, the wine begin now for you? What time of day? So around two sometimes and sometimes around four and it depends. Living the dream. But I'm lucky. I'm lucky to be able to, you know, there are a lot of people who are going out there and working so hard and, you know, the best thing that we can do is just Stay put. Here's a quick challenge for you, Alex. What day of the week is it? <clears throat> Today's Friday. The streamers would come down if I had them set. <laughs> oh, the crowd goes wild. To be fair, there was about a four or five second delay there. To be honest, in the normal world, it would take me that long to remember what day it was anyway. You, you do have one thing in your place that's bringing you happiness. I think it's yeah. time for you, Alex Dario to show us your pet. Is it, is it Levon? Levon. Where's he hiding? What's going on? You're a star. You're gonna be on TV or something. Levon? This is Levon's moment to shine. Oh, to shine. Well, he does have an Instagram account. He shines on there. <laughs> have you and Levon grown closer in, in quarantine? No, we have always been very close. I've had this dog for a long time. He's lived with me in multiple apartments and now my house. And um, if anything, he's a little irritated. <laughs> I think he's like, well, this is a lot of commotion with these women and their wine. They're always drunk before the sun sets. It's a lot. So he definitely comes over and stares at us around five o'clock because he knows it's dinner time and he knows we've forgotten. Uh, in the midst of all this madness, you've dropped the new movie. The new movie is We Summon the Darkness, which almost sounds like a spell cast upon the society. It sounds like you brought this all on us. Alex, do you want to take responsibility? No, how dare you? <laughs> I don't want to take responsibility, but but I will take responsibility for making a cool movie. There you go. <laughs> Definitely didn't expect when we were shooting it that we'd be releasing it under such strange circumstances, but it's a cool comedy horror. People seem to like it. You can go check out some reviews. Some of my films, I would not recommend that more. <laughs> We've been testing all the guests on Stir Crazy to see if they have talents in this time, if they've developed new talents, if they have old talents. Alex, do you have a special talent? I have a talent. I have a, I have a thing I used to do when I was, when I used to audition in New York, um, when I was a kid, the casting directors would always ask us to do a special talent, like to sort of show our personality, I guess. And for some reason, I couldn't come up with anything except this one dumb thing, which is where I walk on my knees while I'm cross-legged. Tension is palpable. Going cross-legged. Here we go. Too old. Let's see if I can. Try this at home, folks. Here she goes. Oh my god! <laughs> did um did that win you a lot of roles when you were a kid? When you no did... no no. No, I, I can't, I can honestly tell you, I never got a job for any audition in which I did that special talent. Well, I think things are going to change today. You are suddenly cast in the new Star Wars movie. The new I Marvel hope movie. the casting directors will see this. <laughs> You've done a few films that have touched in, in the horror genre a little bit. You've probably screamed quite a bit in films throughout your career. Yes. Could some primal screaming help us through this scenario? We have to try it. So you're the expert here. How long do you think we should scream for? What type of scream? Walk me through this. My roommates might run in, first of all. That'll be exciting. But I think if we're going to do a primal scream, it's got to just come from, and we've just got to feel it. You know, it's got to be an instinct. Like you just got to do it and feel it. So we, on the count of three, you ready? Yeah, I'm ready. Okay, let's see who One. runs in. 
One, two, two three. I feel better. I don't think your roommates care about you. No one's come. No, they don't, and neither does my dog. He's just chilling. This is Would You Rather Quarantine Edition. Would you rather be stuck for a year in quarantine with a co-star that you hated the most or with no one at all? Whew, no one at all. <laughs> oh, I, and that's not even to say that there's a co-star I've hated the most. Cause, right. But. Okay, you can chill on your own. You can, you can make it work. Although, now would be a very good time to murder someone. <laughs> no one's looking for anyone. Okay. I'm going to leave now, but this has been great. <laughs> <laughs> Would you rather only be able to watch San Andreas or Percy Jackson forever on a loop? Oh, Jesus Christ. Um, <laughs> I guess Percy Jackson. I I was going to say San Andreas. Percy Jackson, if it's forever, like you're like there's a nostalgia, there's more of a nostalgia associated with Percy Jackson for me. Sure. So maybe it would be like nice. I don't know. All right, I'm going to go through some of your co-stars. You tell me if you want them on your quarantine. So the big guy, The Rock, Dwayne Johnson. Do you want him in there with you? Yes. <laughs> What's he gonna do for you? What's what? What per, is he gonna be your personal trainer, your motivational speaker? Highly motivational. Yep. Very kind. I feel like you see, he's such a great father with his kids, and you know, like we all need a good father figure around. Um, your old buddy Zac Efron. Do you want him in, on the quarantine? Of course. I feel like again, like he has survival skills. Yeah. If things were to really go wrong, yeah, he's fun. I feel like there's a lot of grooming. I feel like he spends more time in the bathroom than you do. Well, that's good. I have two bathrooms, so perfect. Yeah. <laughs> Great. You want Woody Harrelson, your True Detective co-star, on the quarantine? I mean, am I supposed to say no to any of these? I mean, do I want a bunch of big celebrities living in my house with me? Sure. I mean, yeah. That, so I know the answer to the next one, Lady Gaga, your American Horror Story. Oh. Okay, well, if I had to pick one of the bunch, I'd want Lady Gaga with me. She is awesome. <laughs> Not that they aren't awesome, but you know, girls got to stick together. Let's play some charades, Alex. You ready? Okay. One word. Three syllables. Scream, scream, uh, screaming. Uh, uh, axe murder, Texas Chainsaw Massacre, uh, 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 American Horror Story. Uh, uh, it's a face, um, clown, uh, clown, uh, the, the clowning, the cl clown, uh, Joker, Joker, uh, uh, makeup. <laughs> what was it? Leatherface. Oh, I had Texas Chainsaw Massacre. Was, you so said face at one point, and you said Texas Chainsaw Massacre, and I, I could have done something better. I could have done something better. It's my fault. No, it's my fault. Let's see if I do any better. I'm going to give you uh, a okay. gonna... movie. One word. Beautiful. Running. Baywatch. <laughs> that was a bit, that was that was very good. I mean, that's my audition video for the sequel. Let's make it happen. I mean, I got it instantly. You, you, it was perfect. It's been wonderful. We've learned a lot about you today. We've seen special talents. We've met Levon. This has been a win. Good. I'm glad you feel that way. For a distraction, guys, go check out We Summon the Darkness. It's out right now on VOD, everywhere you can get movies right now. Uh, Alex, it's good to catch up with you. Stay you sane, stay safe, and I hope to see you in better times. Thank you.